Today we're here with Love, CEO from TechAllution, and we're very excited to explore how TechAllution uses Anthos. But first, Love, thanks for joining us. Can you tell us a bit more about what TechAllution does and what it's like to be a Google Cloud partner? Thank you, Mark, for having me on the show. TechAllution is a next-gen digital transformation company, and we're really proud to be at the heart of the digital transformation that's happening in the world right now. Data is power, right? Uh, but when you have too much data, it can turn into noise and paralyze a business. What we do as a company, we leverage the power of cloud, specifically Google Cloud and AI, to help businesses go from reactive to proactive and predictive. As a Google Cloud partner, we specialize in Kubernetes, helping companies from strategy, architecture, implementation, and then manage services, the full life cycle of a Kubernetes experience, and most recently, we've been very involved with Anthos since it went GA back in April uh, because we have a deep expertise in the hybrid cloud space and we work with various different hybrid cloud technologies and we find Anthos to be uh, one of the best. And uh, <clears throat> we're on a mission right now to share uh, the benefits of Anthos with the world. Yeah, it's great to hear about how TechAllution can help these companies adopt like a very digital strategy. So can you tell us a bit more about specifically how Anthos helps enable that? Yeah, so I just want to take a moment, look at what is Anthos. Anthos is essentially Kubernetes and all of the bells and whistles around Kubernetes on the Google Cloud being packaged so that you can bring it to your uh, data center on-prem or any other cloud. And you can have that truly flexible build once, deploy anywhere experience. Now, plain Kubernetes also somewhat does that, but Anthos is enterprise grade, it allows you to do that very, very efficiently. There are UI tools and automation built into it for the enterprise. We um, work with, uh, mostly we're seeing companies that are heavily regulated in banking, healthcare, gov, and a little bit of telco, where they cannot move and modernize their entire application directly to public cloud for those reasons that I mentioned. So Anthos is really a great solution for them to start modernizing in place or their cloud of choice, and then to be able to slowly, as it proves itself, to be able to move some of the workloads to the public cloud. And Anthos allows them to do that uh, in a very efficient and very rapid manner. Yeah, it makes sense that the, the value prop there exists in being able to, like you said, write once, deploy in multiple places, especially as environments are becoming both a combination of hybrid and multi-cloud. The ability to scale it out there is very valuable. Can you share a little bit more about some of the customers that you've worked with and how Anthos has kind of helped them? Sure. We're seeing a lot of traction working with customers in healthcare, finance. I'll take healthcare as an example. Uh, let's say a SaaS provider who's serving uh, to hospitals and other healthcare institutions where they're providing software that uh, ends up um, recording and storing a lot of patient data. That's very sensitive data, very highly regulated. So typically, um, you know, those would run on prem or on data center, but now the cloud is very mature, very secure, and sometimes more secure than your on prem data center. But there are a lot of larger organizations in the healthcare space that. A, may not be comfortable with running their patient data on somebody else's public cloud and shared with, with other tenants, or due to regulations or whatever the reason may be, they're not comfortable with that. So the SaaS provider, by building and modernizing the application base and their data on an, a Kubernetes Anthos-based solution, they're able to make a choice. They could serve some customers on GCP where their application runs, or they could, with the click of a button, deploy that same solution on-prem to their larger enterprise organizations that want to run on-prem. So that's one case study, similar case studies we're seeing in finance. Uh, but the one that's very interesting, a trend that I've seen emerge, is in the telco sector. As uh, 5G becomes a reality, we're seeing an emergence of a lot of uh, IoT, smart city type of solutions that's generating a lot of data in real time over 5G. And the kind of data and compute that they need requires an edge-based solution. Because even though the throughput is faster, going sending all this data on the cloud and get a decision back 
may not be fast enough in this new world. So Anthos actually has been a really great solution to bring some of that compute on the edge, local level, and, and telcos are building solutions around that. And then for other services, you could go to the public cloud. And the, the true benefit of Anthos in a deployment like that, it's very large scale. And managing all of the nodes across, across let's say, uh, all the deployments out there, all the cities and public cloud, uh, can be very, very difficult without a product like Anthos. It's great to hear about where Anthos is actually solving these problems and how technology is continuing to increase, and Anthos is helping make that manageable. Love, thank you so much for coming on and telling us a bit more about it. Thank you, Mark, for having me on the show. It's a pleasure. Absolutely. If you'd like to learn more about TechEvolution, you can visit techevolution.com. Thanks for watching, and stay tuned for more great episodes of Stack Chat.